Hello. Welcome to Squid Essays. Inking your academic pen. My name is Julie and I will be your instructor as we read through Should Cell Phones Be Allowed in College Classrooms? Essay. The article source is embedded in the video description below. Feel free to read along. Please note that you can get a custom, plagiarism free essay for as little as $10 a page at Squid Essays. The link is in the description. I think cell phones should an unregistered trademark to be allowed in college classrooms. Nowadays, parents buy a cell phone for their teenager, in order to contact them more conveniently. But a lot of students bring their cell phone to the college, during class. If cell phones should an unregistered trademark to be banned in classrooms, we will often see this scene, during the class, a student unregistered trademark s cell phone rang, so the student answered. Meanwhile, the teacher stopped teaching and waiting while the student was answering his cell phone, but other students were distracted from classes. After a few minutes when the teacher started talking, another student cell phone rang again, so the teacher and other students were distracted again. Like that scene, how do you think? Of course, classroom is an unregistered trademark TA coffee shop. Therefore, I think that cell phone should not be allowed in the college classroom. There are several reasons why cell phones should not be allowed in the college classroom. First at all, if cell phone could use in the classroom, it would disturb the teacher and students during class. In the class, when the teacher is talking, students should listen attentively. If cell phones should be allowed in the classroom, what would happen? For example, last semester, an English class, while the teacher was talking something in the class and a student unregistered trademark as cell phones rang. At that time, we had stopped to attend to the teacher, and instead, we attended to the student whose cell phone rang. Our teacher stopped talking and waited. Following, another student unregistered trademark as cell phone rang, and the student started answer cell phone too. Meanwhile, a student said he want to call phone to his family. Unfortunately, the class is interrupted constantly. As a result, the teacher can unregister trademark to complete the teaching plan, and students WOULD and unregister trademark to get complete learning. In order not to be disturbed during class, cell phones should an unregister trademark to be allowed in college classroom. Second, cell phones can help students cheat on test. If cell phones should be allowed in the classroom, of course, it would be allowed use on the test too. Students would use cell phones to send message to each other or other person. For example, before I saw a few times on test in other class, my classmate used cell phones and message to each other and search test information. So if cell phone can use during test, chi would happen ordinarily. As a result, College WOULD and unregistered trademark T correctly evaluate students' learning. Allowing cell phones in college classrooms would condone cheating on tests, allowing for students to get unfair test grades, and would only prove detrimental in preparation for life in the real world. Third, cell phones have full attractive play game, students would distract in the classroom. While the teacher was talking about the course content, students should be attentive to hear teacher talking about something in class. If cell phones should be allowed in the classroom, so there are a lot of play game and the cell phone will be allowed to play in class. For example, I like play game in my cell phone, because now people have developed a lot of interesting cell phone games, very attractive. I usually play on the night before sleeping. If teachers said we could use cell phone during class, I would play game in the class time, I thought if teacher can unregister trademark to ban my use cell phone during class. IWOULD and unregistered trademark T limit me to play game using cell phone. I think the situation is the same as the other students. So if cell phone should be allowed in the college classroom, students WOULD and unregistered trademark T be focused on the teacher unregistered trademark as lectures. But instead, students would play cell phone game all the class time, nobody will be care about what teachers said. Fourth. Expensive cell phone can bring students to compare with each other. Now cell phones are more expensive, because cell phones were developed for a variety of function. The function of each in cell phone has its fee that student must to pay. For students, we usually need go to college and do a lot of homework, 
so we don't unregistered trademark T have more time to get money. If a student brings expensive cell phones to college, in class when other students saw it, somebody maybe wants to get one too, so it would increase in the monthly economic burden on our parents. On the other hand, when students bring their expensive cell phone to college, where can they put it in? Maybe we would be worried about if cell phone lost during college, sometime we would be attracted by others expensive cell phone, then we WOULD an unregistered trademark T be focused in the class. So if cell phone should an unregistered trademark T be allowed in the college classroom, we would put cell phone staying home or use it out of the college classroom. College classroom is a place where provide education for students, but cell phones don unregistered trademark T relate to education. If students need to make an emergency call home, there is a phone in the college unregistered trademark S office. In addition, they can turn on the cell phone out of the classroom after the class. If cell phones should be allowed in the college classrooms, students WOULD in unregistered trademark T attend in studies, and it would allow for the cheating test and for other the social problems. Therefore, Cell phone allowed in the college classroom will bring more bad influence on students' unregistered trademark learning. So cell phone should not be allowed in the classrooms. Thank you for taking your time to listen to me. I hope you enjoyed learning about should cell phones be allowed in college classrooms? Essay as much as I did. Kindly remember that you can get a custom, plagiarism free essay at Squid Essays for as little as little as $10. The link is in the description. See you next time.